the Dell XPS 15 9530, HP Victus 15, Asus RO Zephyrus G14, Surface Laptop Studio 2, and Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro are the most popular laptops for engineering students of 2024. But which is the absolute best? We are going to compare them to each other and score them in various categories, with some categories holding more weight than others. In the end, we'll decide which is the best one based on the final score, and we will declare the absolute winner. Let's dive in. First, we are going to compare them on the performance category, which has a multiplier of 3. The Dell XPS 15 9530 pack a punch with its Intel Core i7-13700H processor and up to 64 gigabytes of RAM, delivering impressive performance for demanding tasks. However, its CPU performance can be inconsistent due to limited turbo boost potential, especially under prolonged workloads. I'd give it a solid 8 out of 10 for performance. HP Victus 15 surprises with its Intel Core i5-13420H processor, which handles gaming and productivity tasks admirably for its price point. While it may not match the raw power of higher-end models, it offers exceptional value for money. I've been impressed by its capabilities, rating it 7 out of 10 for performance. Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 impresses with its AMD Ryzen R9 8945HS processor, delivering stellar performance in both gaming and productivity tasks. I've found it handles demanding games like Starfield and Cyberpunk 2077 with ease, maintaining 50 to 60 frames per second at high settings. This powerhouse earns a well-deserved 9 out of 10 for performance. Up next, Surface Laptop Studio 2 boasts an Intel Core i7-13700H processor and up to 64 gigabytes of RAM, offering robust performance for creative professionals. In my experience, it handles video editing and 3D rendering tasks smoothly, though it can't quite match the top-tier performance of some competitors. I'd rate it 8 out of 10 for performance. Moving on, the Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro shines with its Intel Core Ultra 7 155H processor, delivering snappy performance for everyday tasks and more demanding workloads. I found it to be incredibly responsive, with the combination of fast DDR5 memory and a quick Samsung SSD making for a speedy experience. This impressive package scores 9 out of 10 for performance. The Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro and Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 tie as winners in the performance category, both scoring 9 points thanks to their powerful processors and smooth user experiences. Next, we are going to compare them on the storage capacity category, which has a multiplier of 2. Dell XPS 15 9530 comes with a 1TB NVMe solid-state drive, which is plenty of space for most users. I found the storage to be lightning fast, allowing me to access my files and boot up applications in seconds, 8 out of 10. On the other hand, HP Victus 15 offers a 500GB SSD, which is decent for a budget laptop, but might fill up quickly if you're working with large files or installing multiple games. I appreciated the quick load times, but I had to be mindful of my storage usage, 6 out of 10. Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 packs a 1TB PCIe Gen 4 SSD, providing ample space and blazing fast read slash write speeds. I was impressed by how quickly I could transfer large video files and load resource-heavy games. 9 out of 10. Up next, Surface Laptop Studio 2 comes with a 1TB NVMe SSD, offering plenty of space for creative projects and a smooth Windows experience. I found the storage to be more than adequate for my needs, but the lack of user upgradability is a bit disappointing. 8 out of 10. Next, the Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro features a 512GB NVMe SSD, which is a bit on the lower side for its price range. While the storage was snappy and responsive, I found myself reaching for external drives sooner than I'd like. 7 out of 10. The Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 takes the crown in this category with its spacious and speedy 1TB PCE Gen 4 SSD, scoring 9 points for its excellent balance of capacity and performance. Next, we are going to compare them on the portability category, which has a multiplier of 1.5. The Dell XPS 15 9530E is a sleek and premium laptop that weighs just 1.92 kilograms, making it relatively easy to carry around. However, its 15.6-inch screen might be a bit too large for some users who prioritize ultimate portability. I give it 8 out of 10 for portability. On the other hand, HP Victus 15 is a budget-friendly option, but at 2.29 kilograms, it's on the heavier side for a 15.6-inch laptop. The bulky design doesn't help its case either, making it less ideal for frequent travelers. I rate it 6 out of 10 for portability. Up next, Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 is a compact powerhouse, weighing only 1.72 kilograms with a 14-inch screen. It's impressively thin at 19.5 millimeters, making it a joy to carry around in my backpack. I give it a solid 9 out of 10 for portability. On the other hand, Surface Laptop Studio 2 strikes a balance between performance and portability, weighing 1.89 kilograms for the 14.4-inch model. The unique hinge design adds some bulk, but it's still manageable for daily commutes. I rate it 8 out of 10 for portability.
Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro is the winner in this category, tipping the scales at a mere 1.23 kilograms for the 14-inch model. The ultra-thin 11.7mm profile makes it feel almost non-existent in my bag, earning it a perfect 10 out of 10 for portability. The Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro takes the crown with a perfect score of 10, thanks to its incredibly lightweight design and slim profile that make it a dream to carry around. Next, we are going to compare them on the Graphics Capabilities category, which has a multiplier of 2. The Dell XPS 159530 offers an RTX 4070 GPU, albeit limited to 40 watts due to thermal constraints. While it provides decent 1080p gaming performance, the power limitation holds back its full potential. I'd give it a 7 out of 10 for graphics capabilities. Next up, HP Victus 15 comes with a far from new GeForce GTX 1650 GPU, which delivers playable frame rates at low to medium settings. However, it's at the bottom of the pack compared to modern gaming laptops. I found it struggles with newer titles, scoring it a 5 out of 10. On the other hand, Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 packs an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4070 laptop GPU, which handles most games with ease. I was impressed by its ability to run Doom Eternal at a 120 to 130 frames per second with DLSS enabled. It earns an 8 out of 10 for its strong graphics performance. Moving on, the Surface Laptop Studio 2 features options up to an NVIDIA RTX 4060 GPU with an 80-watt TDP. While it offers good performance for creative tasks, I found it doesn't see massive improvements over the RTX 4050 model due to power limitations. I'd rate it 7 out of 10 for graphics capabilities. Up next, Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro relies on integrated Intel Arc graphics, which doesn't match the power of dedicated GPUs. While it's sufficient for everyday tasks, I found it lacking for serious gaming or demanding creative work. It scores a 4 out of 10 for graphics capabilities. The Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 takes the crown with its powerful RTX 4070 GPU, scoring 8 points for its ability to handle demanding games with impressive frame rates and support for DLSS technology. Finally, we are going to compare them on the battery life category, which has a multiplier of 1.5. The Dell XPS 15 9530E offers impressive battery life, lasting over 10 hours for basic office tasks, which is excellent for a powerful laptop with a large display. However, it falls short of Dell's advertised 11-hour battery life claim, which might disappoint some users, 8 out of 10. On the other hand, HP Victus 15 struggles in the battery department, providing only about 4 hours of battery life for normal tasks and even less when gaming. On the bright side, it charges relatively quickly, which somewhat mitigates the short battery life. 5 out of 10. Up next, Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 delivers a respectable 6 hours and 45 minutes of battery life, which is decent for a gaming laptop, but falls short compared to previous versions that ran for over 10 hours. Asus promises future driver updates to improve longevity, so there's potential for improvement. 7 out of 10. On the other hand, Surface Laptop Studio 2 impresses with its battery performance lasting 9 hours and 31 minutes in laptop battery life tests. While it doesn't quite reach Microsoft's claimed 18 hours, it still provides enough juice to get through a full workday. 8 out of 10. Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro shines with its 13-hour battery life, which is impressive for such a lightweight and powerful device. Despite the relatively small 62-watt-hour battery, Samsung's efficient design allows for extended use on a single charge. 9 out of 10. The Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro takes the crown in the battery life category with 9 points, thanks to its impressive 13-hour battery life in a slim and lightweight package. The results of our comparison show each product shines in its own way, but the Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 stands out with its score of 85. This powerhouse laptop excels in performance, storage capacity, and graphics capabilities, making it a top choice for both gamers and productivity enthusiasts. I've experienced firsthand its ability to seamlessly handle demanding tasks, from running complex engineering software to playing the latest Churchill A games. Its combination of a robust AMD Ryzen R9 8945HS processor and a top-tier NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4070 GPU ensures that it delivers on all fronts. Whether you're an engineering student or a creative professional, the G14 sets a high bar with its all-around impressive specs and user experience. Now, let's talk about the other contenders that brought their A-game to the table. The Dell XPS 15 9530 and Surface Laptop Studio 2, both tied with an impressive score of 78, offering balanced and robust performance across various categories. The XPS 15 is perfect for those who need substantial power without sacrificing too much battery life or portability, while the Surface Laptop Studio 2 stands out with its innovative design and excellent performance for creative tasks. The Samsung Galaxy Book 4 Pro also deserves mention with its score of 77.5, boasting unbeatable portability and battery life. Despite its lower score in graphics, it's a dream for every day use and long hours. Lastly, the HP Victus 15 may have a final score of 59.5, but it offers excellent value for budget-conscious buyers looking for solid performance. Each laptop has its unique strengths, so depending on your specific needs, any of these can be the right choice for you.